This week, good nog. <coughs> <coughs> Cough demonstration. And alcoholic or drinking problem. This is the front page. Hey everybody, welcome to the front page, the show where we talk about a lot of silly stories from the website reddit.com. My name is Samantha Garcia. And I'm Liz Hoffman. And we are now squarely into December. Oh, we are. We've come to the very end, of, well, we're not at the very, very no, end of the year. No, no, let's not are. rush it. Oh, I'm not ready. No, I'm nor am I. Ready. Nor am I. I was, I was looking through, because like normally I try and buy things for Christmas gifts mm-hmm. throughout the year, and I in my head I had... I thought all of these things that I picked up during the year and then I finally sat down this past week and like looked through everything yeah. and I was like, I don't have anywhere <laughs> the amount of stuff I thought I had. So now I'm feeling the Christmas present panic yeah, settling definitely. in where I'm like, oh shit. Yeah. It's like, why do I like so many people? Right. I want to get everybody a little something. Right. And I try so hard to avoid getting people gifts, but then... People will get me a gift, and then it's like, well, shit, now I'm on the hook for the rest of our lives, so long as we are friends. <laughs> now, clearly, we're getting each other real gifts. We're those kinds of friends now. Thanks. So I went from only buying for my family, like, six or seven years ago, yeah. to now a, a fairly sizable list. And I uh, like all those people. And I like them all so much. Yes. Such is our lives. Uh, let's, uh, let's drink to that. Let's drink to that. I have the cocktail this week. Ah! Oh, how the tables have turned. I know. Oh, my goodness. Up is down. Left is right. I don't know what's happening. Uh, if, <laughs> if you are at all normal viewers of our little web series here, you may recall that about a month ago, I mentioned uh, I was making some homemade eggnog. Yes. And... I was unsure as to how it was going to turn out. So. I'm very curious. Bum, ba, dum. Yep. I, I don't do this first, guys. I'm so confused. So, I present to you, submitted to the subreddit, and I shit you not, this is an actual subreddit, Eggnog. What? Yes. What? Yes. There. What? There is. I, I typed in Eggnog. In the search function, and there is an eggnog subreddit. Who knew? Uh, submitted by Reba J O. Uh, this is in fact the exact eggnog recipe I used. It comes to us from Alton Brown, uh, who's you know pretty cool food pretty guy great. and pretty all the awesome. things he does. Pretty awesome cutthroat kitchen. Yeah, you, know, you may know. Uh, and it is called my aged eggnog recipe. So it is an aged eggnog recipe, meaning you make it and then you stick it in your fridge for a really long time. Okay. Uh, which I think is why I brought it up last yeah. time I mentioned it, because I was like, I did this. It might kill us all. Yeah. Um, but we're going to see. Because I brought it. Are you going to try it now? Yes. Yeah. I brought it. Let's let's give it a try. Look at that. It's been sitting in my fridge for a month. It smells good. It's got a nice uh, yeah. consistency to it. Mm. It looks great. Yeah. Cheers. cheers. Oh my god, guys! I like it. Yeah, it's good, right? That's outstanding. Yeah, it's, and it's actually mellowed a lot since when? <laughs> since the beginning, like the s- beginning. S- since I made it, yeah. Because I, uh, I didn't have a full glass of it when I made it, but I was like, okay, I kind of want to yeah. see the difference. Yeah. So I took a little bit of a taste of it before I put it in the fridge Mm -hmm. and it was very very strongly alcohol Mm -hmm. on the front this is very smooth and this is uh this has gotten quite smooth this is really nice Mm. Clifton oh yeah it's really good feelings I know yeah definitely yay I didn't kill us yay yay so uh so what it is is 12 large eggs Wow. 12 egg yolks. You don't need the whites. You just throw those away. A dozen egg yolks. A dozen egg yolks. Okay. Literally just buy a thing of eggs and crack those suckers. Put them in. Put them in. Yeah. 
uh, a pound of sugar. Yeah. Uh, a pint of half and half. A pint of whole milk. Jesus Christ. And a pint of heavy cream. Fucking footballs. Yeah. Uh, and then a cup of Jamaican rum. It literally says Jamaican rum. It must be Jamaican it rum. It must be Jamaican. And I, I, I shit you not, like I literally was standing in Jewel going, what is Jamaican rum as opposed to non rum, yeah. Google? So uh, it, it gave me some brands that were Jamaican rum. Okay. I believe I used a Cruzon. Okay. Aged rum. Uh, one cup cognac, which, spoiler alert, is the most expensive ingredient in the entire recipe. Yeah. It's not cheap. I had never bought cognac before, because why would I? Uh, how, how much does a bottle of cognac run you these days? Like 40 bucks. Fuck off! Yeah. Yeah. I bought um, their slightly less cognac than and slightly more... I think I put an extra bourbon in this one because it was like $40 for a full, like the regular size bottle or the tiny bottle, which was just shy of one cup, was like 19. Oh my God. Or maybe it was 17. And I was like, well, we are going to, we're yeah. going to take the tiny bottle. Thank yeah. you. As opposed Ooh. to the full size bottle of rum that was on sale for oh, yeah. $11. And the full size uh, bottle oh, I see. I see of bourbon saying. that was on sale for thirteen, the cognac. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So be prepared to drop a little money on the cognac Ooh. if you want to do this recipe. But it's, it's worth, worth it. it. Oh my it's god, worth it. this it's is actually delicious. Worth it. Um, and you can make two. Like I said, mm -hmm. um, it was slightly under a cup. It was like yeah. I would say like six eighths of a cup. And then you, with you bump the it a little. tiny bottle of cognac, and I just bumped it up a little with the bourbon. Yeah. So a cup of rum, a cup of cognac, a cup of bourbon, and then uh, freshly grated nutmeg. And uh, ta -ta. and apparently, despite the massive amount of dairy, if you have that much booze in there, it'll do fine in your fridge for a month. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So give it a try. It works. It works. And it makes, I mean, this is, this is a sizable amount yeah. of eggnog. There's still, a half of it is sitting in my fridge mm -hmm. for later consumption. Woo. Woo. And the recipe does say, like, you can drink it right away. And I tried it right away, and it, it was fine. Yeah. But I was like, oh, hella alcoholic. Mm -hmm. uh, definitely after almost a full month, it, it has mellowed nicely. And yeah. the recipe does say, like, if you can leave it for two months... It will be even better. Ooh. So if you can remember to make this at the beginning of October and well, hold on to it and not drink it, which would be the hard part. Right now, I mean, we're at the beginning of December. It's been a month, mm -hmm. which means at actual Christmas time, actual That is New true. Year's time, it will be almost it'll two be months. Just right. Yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> this is not going to last until actual Christmas, no. though. But I would argue you probably made it at the optimal time. Mm -hmm. No, I'm real happy with this. And, yeah. Uh, I'm going to look forward to finishing the rest of it. I mean, if you want any help, I'm there for you. I, thank you. I'm, I You're going to take one for the team. Show up and be there. You're such well, a good just friend. For you. Just for such you. a good friend. <laughs> not for anybody else. No. Not for any other eggnog. No. I've had other eggnogs that are not mm. as good as this. This is, yeah, not to do my own horn, but this is pretty damn good. <laughs> Submitted by Doc in a Box to subreddit Funny. Alcoholic? We can help. <laughs> what liquor own delivery that's not where i thought that was gonna go no it wasn't where i thought it was gonna go either which is why i was like that's amazing i mm, uh, 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 i think it's funny i think it's funny i i want to take it in the spirit in which <laughs> it is meant to be taken I'm just a little like eh, mm, a little bad taste uh, i want it to be are you already drunk we can help Oh, I think that would bother me a little less. Okay. And still have the same point, I think. All right. You like booze? We can help. Yeah. 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 This to me suggests, do you have a problem with alcohol? Uh, We're going to make that problem worse. Oh, but I wouldn't say like we refer to ourselves as alcoholic all the time. Yeah. We're not actual alcoholics. It bothers me a little that we use that phrase as often as we do. Okay. Because I don't think we are actually alcoholics. No, I don't think we are actually alcoholics. Oh, so, all right. We will stop using that phrase. I feel like it's a, it's a, it's, it's a word that means a real thing. Got it. I see. And we're 
cheapening it and trivializing it. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. We will stop using that phrase. Thanks. You're welcome. We are very heavy drinkers. We are ex- extremely heavy drinkers. Yeah. Uh, but not alcoholics. I don't, I don't think we're actual alcoholics. No. So. My doctor might beg to differ. Like, you know, you go for your physical and they're like, so what? Do you like do zero drinks a week or like I think three drinks a week? And I'm like, yeah, if by week you mean Saturday afternoon. Yeah. Let us not include Sunday and Monday. No. And, and Friday. Wednesday. Um, Let's never include Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah. No. Mm. But I think everyone fudges the truth. Oh, everyone on that lies question. on that. I think Absolutely. anything involving, like, how much do you consume of any one thing, we're all fudging it a little. Oh, yeah, because I'm also not telling them how much sugar I we... legitimately consume in a week. Also, not how much cheese mm. I consume in any given day. Every now and then I'll, I'll come across a doctor who doesn't understand vegetarianism, and they'll be like, but what do you mean by that? Like, How is that questionable? I don't understand I don't how even... that Me... is confusing. But you're not uh, a sickly waif of a human, like... <laughs> Nope. Feeling pretty okay. No. But you must have some kind of bone deficiency or something. Like, no. Not that I know of. No. I mean, I am not, not a doctor. Vegan. So, But even when I was vegan, I didn't have any kind of like weird bone deficiency uh, no, or anything. That is true. You were a perfectly healthy human being. I'm pretty healthy then, too. Yeah. Uh, and they were Sam derives all her protein from booze. That's right. It's my superpower. I put I put vegetables and stuff in my booze hall, and this yeah. this has a lot of protein. I'm sure. Oh yeah, it's got some it's, calcium. It's chock full of calcium. Yeah, the booze doesn't hurt that at this all. This is uh, making sure that I do not get osteoporosis. Cheers to that. Yeah. You know, it, it should have been drinking problem. We can help. See that I like more too. Oh, I do like that more. Yes. Because that's clever. Because like you do have a problem because you're out of booze. Right. Ah. Uh, uh, I figured it out. What is the actual name of this company? Is it literally just called Liquor Home Delivery? I don't think it matters. Maybe if we called the number, we would find out. Maybe we would. And then we could tell them, hey, our producer came up with a better idea. A card that won't be so offensive. In case you were wondering. <laughs> Submitted by Kamate to subreddit GIF Recipes yeah. uh, called A Little Something at Home. Okay. That's you know, pour water, water in a glass. Well, I don't know what that is. I don't either. Never heard of it. Liquid soap. I've got that lying around. Not Whoa, a problem. What the? Yep. This is not for consumption. Okay. Nope. I, I this thought is a it five was. minute craft. I was very confused. And then you're just going to add good old hydrogen peroxide. Oh my God. Right? Why? Wait, what? Why? What is this? What purpose does it serve? Why are you doing this? Why? It's like it turned into an alien and tried to eat you. Right? I don't understand. Oh my god. What happens next? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what is the next chapter? Does this delight small children? Do you... It's got to because it's got me glued to the damn thing and I already know what happens. Do you clean with that? Does this just mean throw away that vase? Because you're never getting all of that out? Because what happens when you pour more water and or and liquid soap in there? And what the fuck is potassium permanganate? I, I don't know. I don't know. Why? I don't know. Because I have water, I have liquid dish soap, and I have hydrogen peroxide. Oh, so you're one ingredient away from this from monstrosity. this. Potassium permanganate. But what I is it? Where, where do I get that? it? I don't know. I d- I'm not going to lie. I kind of want to do this now. Yeah? Yeah, look at that. You have, uh, you're, you're around some young people from time to time, from right? From time to time. Maybe you can figure out. Is it out. like play doh Is it slimy? What? I don't know. Because that, I mean, then, again, what is the end goal with this? Is it just this wow moment of it went from being a yeah. liquid to being a, a I think solid? So. I think so. And then what? You just throw it in the trash? I don't understand. I don't know. I want to challenge. Oh, dear. Challenge. We need to do this. Do we have to? We have to. We have to. We have to do this and then like record it and put it up on like the Facebook or the Twitter or whatever. On one of those media platforms? <laughs> right. Yep. Yep. Snapchat. 
<laughs> I don't. I don't have. Are Snapchat. we too late to the Snapchat boat? I'm 36. <laughs> I don't understand anything beyond Facebook and Twitter. <laughs> oh my god, old. it's just so bizarre. I know it's it's seriously like something out of an alien movie yeah. where it like jumps out and eats your face. Yeah. When we uh, help create Grabbers Two Electric Boogaloo, <gasps> yes! Yes! we will suggest this yes! special effect. Yes. This is what was missing from Grabbers. Yep. 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 Grabbers 2. Like a bungalow. We'll put in the sequel. I love it. Submitted by <clears throat> Little Beatles to the subreddit Funny. How could you possibly beat that name? Mm. Uh, this is called Sign at My Local Chemists. Use words to describe your <laughs> cough. Live demo, not necessary. The fact that they even needed to put that sign out. <laughs> I just don't don't cough in my face. It, something is wrong with me. Like no. Okay, well, it's just rude. It's rude, but I also have to say sometimes I don't have the vocabulary to describe things. Okay, and sometimes showing is better than is telling. Better than telling show don't tell. I mean, I'm not gonna walk up to you and like be this close to you and cough in your face. That is rude. Don't do that. But I'm going to, like, go off to the side and be like, okay, listen hard. I'm going to do it now. Listen hard. <laughs> it's important that you understand the subtleties of the raspiness of the cough. Right. That's, we, that's really where the secret to this diagnosis is going to be, obviously. It could be. Yeah. Whether it's, like, chest. Okay. Sure. Lungs, or, like, full throat. Full throat. Or up in the nasal cavity. Right. Yep. Yes. Okay. All right. This, yep, you make a valid point. I'm just saying. There are plenty of things. I'm bad at describing particular ailments. feelings or ailments. Also, some emotions. Sometimes when asked, like, how are you feeling? I'll be like, Rah! I'm showing That's you how I'm feeling. interpretive dance. Right? Why can't Why you, you understand? Get that? Why don't you understand what I'm trying to tell you? Yeah. I have done everything I can. <laughs> I've used all of my... <laughs> I've used my instrument. Knowledge of Buto theater. <laughs> I don't understand what, how to be more clear. What more do you want? <laughs> I've done purpose. everything I could. This is the strongest eggnog I've ever had. <laughs> I'd like I to know, point out. I know, it's so alcoholic. Oh my god. There's so much booze in here. <laughs> That's it. That's we. Oh, oh man. Okay, oh. we gotta go have a sandwich and a glass oh of water God, or do. something. We do. Start the coffee. Oh, I recommend it though. It's really good. It's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> I want a mime troupe to show up at a doctor's office <laughs> and be like, "Of course, they wouldn't be able to say we're gonna now describe to you the ailment no. using the power of mime." <laughs> That's what signs are for. <laughs> because they're mimes. <laughs> they couldn't even cough properly. <laughs> <laughs> too already too much noise. Oh dear. I okay. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this eggnog. Friends at home, I hope mm -hmm. you'll find us on the Facebook, yes. Twitter, the Instagram. Subscribe to our channel over here. Next week, oh man, the shenanigans are gonna go up a notch. The shenanigans are going to go up. It's gonna the get closer ridiculous. Closer we get to Christmas, the more oh, ridiculous. It's gonna just get more uh, ridiculous. Go go make yourself some eggnog. It'll be ready in time for Christmas. That's right. Yep. That is exactly right. You still have three weeks. <laughs> My name's Samantha Garcia. <laughs> and I'm Liz Hoffman. This has been the front page, and we'll see you next week. Bye.